Welcome back. All right, no matter what career path you choose, at some point you're probably going to be serving a customer. Now, being able to manage people and your attitude can be the determining factor whether you move ahead or not. So uh, how do you make the most of your opportunities? Well, our next guest, author Gwen Foster Oglesby, is here to help you. Welcome to First Coast Living. Thank you so much for having me. All right, so we got the book here. We'll talk about that in a sec, but yes. uh, your background, what, how did you, how did you, where did you get your start and how this book came out? Well, actually, I have worked in the call centers for years in customer service. And one thing I always remember, growing up, mm -hmm. my parents, Ruth Foster, Booker T. Foster, they just implemented that desire to have a great work ethic. Yeah. And I think it rubbed off on me. And I found myself working in call centers, and that's where I noticed that even though the product is different in different companies, but the dynamics of a call center is the same. Okay, so you mentioned a good work ethic, and I think that that's crucial when it comes to working at a call center. I worked at a call center very briefly. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but tell us about the skills you need being in a right. call center. In a call center, it's a fast-paced environment, yeah. right? One day it may be a certain process, the next day it may change. So you have to be sure that you're able to uh, adapt and, and conform to whatever the, the gotta need be is. you got to be feet. agile, right? <laughs> Bob and weave, right? You have to do all of that. But one thing also to keep in mind is not to take the customer too serious to the point that it makes you react negatively to them. So you kind of have to have that thick skin per se, yeah. right? You have to be able to be efficient because you want to service the member, but also be mindful of the average handle time as well. You want to have great quality. You want to be professional with your, with your customers as well. Yeah. Now the book is called Call Center, and of course, obviously anybody who works in the call center, great read for you, but everybody in their life needs customer service training. Definitely. Why do you think so? Oh, it's the wave of the world, right? Um, you go to a fast food restaurant, right? You, you need that great customer service. Everything you do, customer service is the fabric of our society. So how, I guess, or what type of advice would you give someone when it comes to dealing with internal and external customers? Right. You want to make sure, in the book, I, I speak to four attributes you should have uh, to be successful when dealing with customers. You want to, I call it iPad, I-P-A-D. Okay. You want to be sure that you have that great integrity. You know, honor what you tell the customer. If you tell the customer you're going to call them back, call them back. Yeah. Right? P is being professional. You want to be professional with your customers, your internal customers as well as your external customers in reference to dress, the way you interact with your customers, the way you interact with your coworkers. Yeah. A is attitude. You want to have that positive attitude. You want to be a team player. You want to have that can-do um, experience. You want to be sure that you are there to reach the common goal of the company. And D is dependability. You got to come to work, right? <laughs> you got to show yeah, up. Yeah, <laughs> you got to show up. Yeah. So if you have those four competencies, you should be successful in the workplace. All right. Most importantly, where do all the call centers in town find this book to give to their employees? <laughs> yeah. Oh, definitely. Well, you can go on Amazon. It's um, online at all bookstores. Uh, you can go to Walmart online, nice. yeah. Target online. Uh, you can also visit my website, www.callcenterthebook.com. Again, that's callcenterthebook.com. It's Love more it. information about myself, the book, and I also have a blog that speaks about customer service and work ethic. Excellent. Perfect. Thanks so much, Gwen. Thank you so much. And you can catch this, you can look at this segment again online at our website, <laughs> First Coast.